What's going on YouTube? Today, coming back at you guys with some big news. As the title says, you know, uh, I'm gonna be revealing to you guys something that's gonna change this channel forever. Yes, I purchased a vehicle from Copart and I'm going to be doing my first rebuild project. Um, you know, this is something I've been thinking about for a while. Uh, I wanna provide to you guys the best content that I can as a automotive you know addict shout out to the car addict but uh you know let me show you guys what i got going on so let's go i'm gonna do some paperwork right now and you'll see it soon so talk to you guys soon guys what's up guys good to see you again uh got my vest on did all the paperwork uh basically it was just the title transfer you know all the paperwork documentation for the car and right now standing right in front of it i know you guys are excited but uh if you were a dedicated viewer of mine, you could have noticed, maybe even predicted which car I might have gotten. And uh, if you remember, there was a specific car at like towards the end of the video that I had kept having my eye on. And I was saying how it might have been a really good car. Had uh, uh, low damage in the front and, um, you know, had low miles with a clean title. So, did my research, found out that this particular car is pretty reliable. Um, and uh, caught my eye. So, without further ado, I think it's time to do the big reveal. Sada! <laughs> Had to go for the BMW. Look at that. That's that German beauty right there. It's gonna be my first, first build, rebuild, I should say. Um, yeah, so right now I'm gonna wait for the tractor to come get it and we'll uh we'll see from there got the tow truck out by lift put it on the lift getting it up on the trailer right now my boy doing his work looking good oh yeah there it goes going up now i'm with my driver he's getting gas he said he was low on diesel he's got the bmw in the back and right now uh we're taking it to the shop that uh my cousin's buddy owns and he's letting me put it uh on the lot keep it there and uh work on it when i can so you know basically the reason i did this is man i want to get some more content for you guys you know you guys come first um and you know i realized that you know uh if you want to achieve your dreams in life you have to take risks sometimes and i'm taking a big financial risk right now by purchasing this car and rebuilding it um and hoping it works because this car is a, you know it's got the clean title it's got the low miles and everything but i don't even know if it turns on uh you know it has some work that needs to be done to it that i'll be talking about later and you know you know you should go through life trying things you know because you never know if uh you could have been something big or done something big if you never tried. So right now, I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know what the outcome of this is going to be. But all I know is I got your guys' support and I got some great content. So I'm going to hit you guys up when I get to the lot. Okay. Ooh. What's going on, YouTube? I'm back. And I'm with the car. As you can see, um, yeah, <laughs> a little bit of uh, work needs to be done. Uh, you know, tow truck took it off of the uh, back and... Uh, you know, I'm talk to you guys a little bit about what I got going on. So, all I know for right now is, you know, it's gonna be a little bit of work. I need to work on some of the AC stuff. I need to add a radiator on there. Got to put the front bumper and everything on there. But uh, this car has, uh, you know, no accidents that I could uh, tell off paper. Um, looks like the owner was just trying to mess with something and just gave up on it. Uh, clean title. 68,000 miles which is very low for a car like this and uh 
you know it's got the v8 4.4 liter i believe um so yeah i'm gonna just show a little bit about the front you know you got the nice white sunroof Let's see interior to me is in real real good condition look at that everything's intact pretty much no uh you know rips in the leather six speed manual and the good thing about this it's got the m trim you can see the m symbol right there see the m symbol on all those pieces interior is pretty intact back of it's pretty good too um something cool i saw is that the wheels even have a little m symbol on them that's pretty cool you know so just taking inventory right now the back uh it's had a lot of parts i'm gonna have to use as you can see there 540i so there you have it guys the first build man it's gonna be amazing keep uh keep an eye on how this front looks it's gonna be very 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 important once this thing is back and it gave it life so that's another uh, video for you guys, man. I'm tired, as you can see, but, you know, I'm going to head out now. i got a lot of work to do with this thing. So if you're new to the channel, please subscribe below. If you're watching and you haven't subscribed, please do so. Uh, and, you know, we'll see, what, we'll see what this takes us. So I'm out, guys. Peace out. Thank you for watching, and I appreciate your support. Take care.